And a warm welcome. Our venue today is the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester City up against West Ham United. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Phil Foden plays with Bernardo Silva out wide and lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. Alphonse Areola begins in goal. Angelo Ogbonna plays alongside Kurt Zuma in central defence. Tomas Socek starts alongside Edison Alvarez in the centre of midfield. And the striker today is Mikel Antonio. Thank you for attending the Etihad Stadium. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, he's given it away. He's beaten his man. Well, if you're the opposing defender, you've really got to keep a weather eye on Erling Haaland. What are you expecting to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, the game plan of the coach is to get the ball into the front players as quickly as possible. He is the player to do it. He's brilliant with his back to goal. We'll link up the play, and he's key to the way they play the game. Oh, this is looking promising. Antonio! Well, he's missed the chance. And the keeper didn't have to do very much. Walker failed to hold it. A chance maybe from the wide position. Who can he pick out? Kovacic. Body in the way. Antonio. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And a bad pass it was. De Bruyne. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Paqueta. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Showing fine vision. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. De Bruyne. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. And 
the Hammers get the ball moving again. Will there be a quick reply from them? There needs to be. Well, you've got to... In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. And it's also going to be a booking. Well, he's absolutely right. It's a penalty and a yellow card. Chance to even things up here. And he puts it away confidently. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. So back on the way. One goal apiece here. Tomas Socek. Oh, great attacking play. Well, defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. A danger here as he runs at them. Kovacic is ready. And an effective clearance. De Bruyne. On to Holland. Nicely timed tackle. Foden. Here's Kovacic, hold on, and a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Fallen behind. Let's see what West Ham do on the response front. Real chance. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Corner kick played in. No trouble at all as far as the keeper was concerned. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long, and this match is level again. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. And there we have it, that brings to an end the first half here at the Etihad. And it really was a stunning first half performance by Erling Haaland, no two ways about that. Well they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. to the area here well not the best clearance De Bruyne 
Very quick thinking there. And they could really get at the opposition. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Paqueta. Just the challenge that was required. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Edson Alvarez and unable to pick out a teammate and that'll be a throw oh, really closing him down superb effort to keep it in and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end and so 30 minutes left for play in this one Antonio, top class defending. And the counter looks on here, options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Terrific block. Referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. And a substitution in the offing. Short and along the ground. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. And intercepted there. This might be ideal for the counter. And he cuts inside. Well, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. Please contact your nearest security guard. Thank you. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Foden. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. And it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Can they forge ahead? And that could be all oh so important. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Phil Foden City move it forward with purpose this could finish it well relying on the goalkeeper well there's not long left now but that just about keeps them in it well having been awarded the corner they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt and space available inside, and quite simply, wide of the target. Well, the decision they have made is to make a triple substitution. He's going forward well here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. 
Mohamed Kudus. A City free kick forthcoming. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Will he play it in? Gives it a go! Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. Did well to win the ball back. And that is that full time here and a win for City. Your verdict? Yes, Derek. Sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition. And that was the case here. They kept going and they eventually got their reward. Well, it truly was a terrific performance by Erling Haaland, really lighting up this game. Well, he was on fire today, not just with his finishing, but also his general play. That was a top-class hat-trick. Holland, he's in here. And a goal to open the score. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, you've got to... And it's also going to be a booking. Well, he's absolutely right. It's a penalty and a yellow card. Chance to even things up here. And he puts it away confidently. Foden, here's Kovacic, hold on, and a goal, in the lead again, fully deserved. Well, that real chance, oh that's textbook goalkeeping. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And, and it's positive from Manchester City. Is it in the cards for them to score a late winner? Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer. And that could be oh so important. Well, relying on the goalkeeper. Well, there's not long left now, but that just about keeps them in it. Will he play it in? Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. 